Welcome to TechSibo.com. This is part 23 of creating responsive website with ASP.NET and Bootstrap. If you haven't watched the previous videos, either you watch the video or download the project files, links in the description. In the last video we displayed all our products, in this video we will create product details page that displays product details and thumbnail. Create a new form with user master page. First create a IMG tag to display our thumbnails. Add some padding top. Add thumbnails class to get responsive image. Now the image is centered so applying a max width style will solve this issue. Now create another division to view our product details. Create a h1 tag for product name and create new class. So here come our bootstrap power. Add column MD to both division. Let's refresh the page. Also increase the line height of product name class. Let's add discount details. We can reuse the class. Let's increase the font size for more readability. So duplicate both class with different name. Use Ctrl plus F5 if the page not refreshed, with this you can clear the cache and recall all CSS and JS files. Now add paragraph tag for price. Add some margin top. Surround this items in a division so that we can add a separation border for better readability. Next is to select size of product, create a division. Add radio button list and change properties.
Add some styling. Next create our add to cart button. Let's give some styling. Create a class. Now our cart button is ready, then add bottom border class to the button division. Give some bottom padding. Next is product description, create another division. Add h5 tag for title. Then create a paragraph tag for contents. Repeat this for other two items. Now our code look like this. Next is to add the policy details. Now our product view page design is ready. That's it guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to our channel and give a thumbs up, it helps our channel a lot, thank you.